Um, we have a guest coming in soon. She checked in yet at all? No, not yet. She's five minutes behind the fucking derelict. That sucks because the things I want to talk about, I want. Dude, let's just go right to the fucking how how. Uh, well, it's just perfect because we were you were saying you're trying to make Christine's pussy wet, and I think this guy you found a video. Of I was trying that knows how to make. Oh, I found a guy who made Christine's pussy. This wet. is our world star uh, today. And it says, uh, stalker or nah, at the bonfire SXM, we'll tweet it out. Yeah, stalker or nah. A woman wakes up to find a video message from a guy that she just met at the bar last night. So that's the backstory. A woman meets this guy. And describe the guy for you. He looks like every guy that would be be aggressive at a bar. Yeah, Jersey Plumbers Union type fella. He definitely, yeah. He looks like... Dooley. Yeah. <laughs> Guy's got a little bit of Dooley in him, for sure. Guy definitely's got some Dooley. I'm a fun guy. Uh, please tell me he has that voice. Oh, oh he's got a funny he one. He's got a funny voice. All sure. right. Well, let's just see this video that he sends to her the next the day. The next meet a girl at a club or a bar? And then you send her this, this video. This is when you get a video it's on him the phone you get in the morning. It's a selfie video of him at his house. Yeah. Good morning, Julia. It's me, Joe. Pause it right there. God <laughs> hey, bless it. Hey, baby, boo-boo chops. Oh, hello, my little China doll. It's your big, <laughs> strong stallion. Your yes. Italian stallion. That is the vibe of what this guy's about to lay on you. He goes, oh. he goes it's your night in shining armor, How baby. How you doing, peach tree? <laughs> Let's say hi. Wish you a great day. Tell you that meeting you yesterday... And getting a look at you was probably one of the greatest moments Dude, of my life. I, love, it, I, I love when guys do the same with they like, let me get a look at it. Like it's a fucking pipe problem or a woman. So like, what do you got going on there? Is, is Let's you, take a look at your situation. Is it, hold on, is your transmission off or is it a beautiful woman? I need to know one of the two things. What I think about this guy. Oh, that goatee. What is. I find interesting is I want to I want to disclaimer this video for myself because how much we're about to laugh at it is that. I've made the mistake. I've definitely texted the girl the next day. Yeah. Church. I've definitely uh, called. Yeah. You know, before before the era of like text, these I've definitely com- called the Jay, girl. But Jay, these are common mistakes. These are excited mistakes. These are mistakes where you meet a beautiful woman and you're very excited to continue the conversation that you had at the bar. What you do L- not do. Luckily, I didn't do this in the era of. Yes. Hey. Hey, everyone in the world on the internet, look at this idiot. <laughs> Dude, I don't know what... I did before that. I mean, this really is the swingers answering machine scene where he's like, oh, yes. God. Oh, God. This we'll tweet that out. Th- John Very Favreau. specifically for a girl. Before I met Carla, my ex, yeah, at the comic strip, I met a girl one night who looked like Leah Remini, young Leah Remini. I think yeah. she was so hot. And she was hitting on me. Kevin Hart was with me. Yeah. She threw it, was throwing it sort of... Not throwing it, but she was definitely showing interest. And gave me your number. And Kev and Keith Robinson said when they when we all <laughs> went our separate ways at night, they go, uh, you know, just don't call her like right away, man. You know, give it a second, man. Let know, let, don't let her know you're so anxious. They knew I'd just broken up with like Cheryl, my, yeah, yeah. my ex ex girlfriend. And they were like, yeah, just be cool, Mel. I was like, yeah, but I was so excited. This is like, I don't even know if this was cell phones. This may have still been house phone. Whatever it was, I hadn't seen swingers yet for all my life. This is a fact. Yeah. And I do exactly what's in this. I call. <sighs> Call again to say, oh, that last match I gave bad uh, information, actually. I actually am going to be in New York tomorrow, uh, and I don't think it's uh, uh, going to be. I mean, it's this. It, it made me cringe, that scene in Swing. Play the scene from Swingers for a second, just uh, to have God. a taste of what we're he talking about. He calls a girl that he gets a number at a bar. Um, when he's I going. did the exact, I mean, almost identical John, thing. Yeah, John Favreau and Hi, Swingers. Uh, Nikki, this is Mike. I met you at the, um, at the Dresden uh, tonight. Uh, I just called to, to say that I had a great time. And you should call me tomorrow or in uh, two two days, uh, whatever. Anyway, uh, my number is two one three five 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 four six seven nine. I mean, perfect. Might want to fast forward though. Yeah, the meltdown's right there. He hangs up, sits hey, for this a little. Help explain right why I'm acting so weird. I just wanted you to know that it, it's not you, it's me. I'm sorry. This is Mike. Calls her right back. Hi, this is Nikki. Leave a message. Hi, Nikki. This is this is Mike. Could you just uh, call me when you get in? I'm going to be up for a while, and I'd just rather speak to you in person instead of trying to fit it all into... It's. I mean, it's perfect. <laughs> yeah, dude, I've it just the, keeps cutting off. And I've done the exact same thing. I've done it with uh, text messages, but never... Where I've been like, hey, I was just joking. 
This is before, but seriously, this if you is, do want to hang out. But he, also another thing. Even if the story I'm telling was in the time of text messages, yeah, like you had to have text messages was like like an extra part of like a p- service plan. Oh yeah, you paid, Nokia, you paid so. per uh, like t- character, characters. Yeah, like, yeah. Oh boy. Uh, I, you know what I think of? I, I, I'm lucky that I didn't have a smart. I did have a smartphone, but video video messages weren't big when I drank, and that uh, would have that would have been a real big. Problem. Thank God, right? Because yeah. I would shit, Christine. Oh <laughs> my God, yeah. I've seen pictures. I've had, I've had to text or like me- privately message people in yeah. a tag picture and be like, "Can you take that picture down, please? I'm hammered and it oh, looks yeah. like my tits about to fall out. Like, what is that doing on the internet?" Yeah, it's uh it's, But luckily there aren't that many. But to send cuz I know by if the I way, met, by the way the answer to your question is the very thing you just said. It looks like I'm hammering my tits hanging out. Why is it up on the internet? Like cuz you're hammering your <laughs> tits about to fall. Out. I don't know. That's a what? that's a find. Uh I I really would have if I would have met a hot girl at a party and been drunk, I would have absolutely done what this guy did where I'm like, "Hey, what's up? It's Dan." Uh Hey, sleepy. It's just me on my pillow all hungover. Dude, we haven't even dove into a tad of what this guy... Show it, by, by the way, it's only a two-minute only a only a two minute video, but this guy gives it all to you. Everything you'd want him to say. Everything. He says. Let's go back to the video. And Wait, what start did you say over, his name start was? Start over. Start over. Mike? Oh, Mike. You were so... Yeah, start from the Good beginning. Good morning, Julia. <laughs> oh. It's me, Joe. Joe, Joe and just Julia. Just want to say hi. Wish you a great day. Tell you that meeting you yesterday and getting a look at you was probably one of the greatest moments of my life. Yikes! You were so beautiful. You don't know how beautiful you are to me. Hold she's on, so pause be- it. She's so this beautiful. Is- she decided to take this and put it out in the yeah, world to make uh, it look like a jerk off. Yeah, I'll tell you this. Julia's is not that cool a chicken. Or <laughs> <laughs> Julia's hot, <laughs> real <laughs> garbage under the layer, sir, uh, under the surface layer. <laughs> that's so. But it's like there's a part of it that's heartbreaking. That he's like, you're the most beautiful thing I've ever seen in my life since my father passed away seven years ago. Rest in peace, Dad. Oh God. Oh God. I'm getting that. all choked up. Oh, the most God. beautiful thing I ever seen oh. since my dad gave me. His- 92 <laughs> Shelby convert oh God oh God it hurts You are the most beautiful thing I've ever seen Since Eli Fucking threw it to that black dude Who held onto his helmet You smell better than My, ma- my mom's grave He got Got my goo God Got my goo Got my goo I'm having a real Got my goo moment Oh God Got, 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 got my goo I miss her so much I Got my goo <laughs> My ma, I miss her so much. Oh, the she would have loved you. <laughs> I saw you across the room and I thought you was going to be interested in all the moyans that was in there. But you looked at me, Joey. I go. You looked at Joey. Yeah? I go. Ma, look, the girls are looking at me. Ma, I go. Yeah, yeah. She's built like a, she's built like a fucking black from the bottom <laughs> down. There ain't no way I'm taking this one down. And I'm like, is she walking over here? This fucking land monster wants a shot. And I see her face like, no, 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 no. She's an angel. <laughs> I mean, just, you're gorgeous. You're precious. <laughs> and uh, But it's been sitting in my mind when you said to me you want to go back with your ex-boyfriend. Pause this. Pause it, I just got dude. something to tell you. I got something to tell you also, for sure. Oh, Joe. There is a 100% chance that... 100% that with minimal, minimal makeup and wig work, we can make Lou Witzke into this guy for, <laughs> yeah. for some sort of a rebuttal video. I want to be this guy. Yeah. It's the worst guy you could be. Just for the uh, video no. purposes. Come on, Lou. Uh, well, I did take a American Community College acting class. Maybe I yeah. can pull it off. Yeah. yeah, Christine's not the only one that's good at Shakespeare. Oh, you went to AAC? <laughs> so what did you good did you, at community college Shakespeare. Did you do any, you did Meisner at AAC? <laughs> ACC? You did, did you, yeah, what did you think <laughs> ACC did that? What did you do, character work or what was more, it was a method? Lou, you could be this guy if we put some hair on you and, and gave you a real jerky off goatee. Oh, yeah, dude. I mean, we could put coffee grounds. You know how you used to do that for little kids who play hobos yeah. at Halloween? <laughs> <laughs> That's a crof- coffee grounds goatee. Lou, it'll be your Oscar moment. Dude, right. this guy, it. it's just it gets sad to sadder when he goes like, I know you were saying to leave you alone last night and that uh, I was bothering you and that you might have to get security involved. But It's just uh, a personality that I'll, I never fully understand is that like, 
Beautiful. The way you looked across the room. Uh-uh. Beautiful. <laughs> I couldn't wait. I said, I'm going to take that girl to church, not just to bed. Look, uh, definitely, I want to give you a good... I'm not gonna, I want to uh, give you the... Uh, listen, wow. I want to lay in there. You're pretty good. Listen, but, baby, you know, also the, the bedroom ain't no kiddie pool to me. You know what I mean? It's <laughs> deep end. But also, I want to take you to a church. I want to introduce you to my brother Lorenzo. I want to do a lot of things. A lot of things that, baby, I know you want to do. I, I, wish this, I wish there was smell-o-vision on this phone so you could smell the gravy. I'm cooking right now. I mean, I got a Stugatz going on. <laughs> <laughs> I got a Stromboli that'll fucking make you shit. Oh, my God. I got a Manigo cooking right now. <laughs> I got some stuffed Manicotti oh that God. I swear to God will make your pussy so slick, you'll fall out your chair. <laughs> oh I mean, you're going to be slippery like some kind of a Branzino fish. <laughs> you're going to slide right out of the bowl. <laughs> I swear to God, and if, you, if you're going to be a brand zino with me, I'm going to leave you bone in. You get what I'm saying? <laughs> How you doing? <laughs> uh, oh, my you God. Know. You're going to be glistening like <laughs> fresh lamb shanks down there. <laughs> Memory. Don't ever go back in the past. I know. Back up, back up. I did. <laughs> go back with your ex-boyfriend. Please erase him from your memory. Don't ever go back in the past. I know. I used to. I, I'm actually a time travel cop. <laughs> <laughs> the stories. I actually go back. I hunt people like Jack the Ripper, Genghis Khan. It's like Bill and Ted, but with like a whole time cut top. But hey, even an old hardened time cop like me <laughs> still needs time to decompress. <laughs> with a lady. He goes, I want you to rent a movie. Time traveler's wife <laughs> and see what we could have together. I just like to know that while I'm fighting off crime in the 40s <laughs> stopping the Al Capones in the world <laughs> that you're here and then when I come back to 2018 I'm not so alone oh come go come go I wanna know when I'm in the thick of the 70s fighting the Gambino family <laughs> getting shot at that when I come back to 2018 that you're gonna have some fresh cookies made for me I'm just saying, I'm getting to a point in my life where I realize when I'm out there in 2081 fighting Robo Kim Jong Un on a jetpack, that I got somewhere to go home to. Oh, God, I'm going to lose it. Listen, and I want you to know that I'll lay in bed with you as long as I can. Even if I do, I got to take a case in the Jurassic Age where I become a dinosaur detective. I want you to know. <laughs> I'm coming back here to love you. <laughs> Let's, go. Let's keep going with it. Oh, my God. I've been there. And I understand when, you know, you're trying to find somebody and you go on dates and nothing compares to your ex. But there is that better person out there. Mm. And, Julia, I promise you it is me. Oh, big. I know. I never happened to meet this other gentleman. Who well, maybe is an okay guy. I mean, <laughs> from what I've heard from you, it sounded like you had a long, intense relationship. <laughs> maybe he was tired of dating a fucking pig who goes out to clubs every night yeah. and just gives guys the number. <laughs> I don't know. You know on, the, on the off chance, this is a good guy. I don't know what he's doing with a pig like you handing out numbers. But anyways, I don't want to take sides. Don't go back with him. Back with me. I'm the winner. Cherish you. I'll make you f- feel like a woman. A real Whoa. woman. Whoa! And believe me. After you experience me, you won't even know who your ex boyfriend is. Oh! So. You know what's funny? Up your- I don't know if he realizes that she's watching this on her phone with her ex boyfriend on her couch. I mean. And she goes, babe, look at the video I got. He goes, was she like, when we were fighting? Like, oh my God, hon, look up from this. He has to, like, look up from eating her box. And- he goes, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, is that the guy? Is that the oh, guy from the club? I'm coming. Oh, yeah. mm-hmm. Oh my God! That weird guy texted me again. Oh, <laughs> she oh, left my. the she left the club that night. Went right to the ex boyfriend. Yeah. Says, says, "Are oh, you still awake, baby? I want to fuck and I want to fuck now." This gross guy was talking to me all night. I mean, I was like, "Miss you." He's oh, like, "Oh fuck!" I gave him his number. Joe, I know you're jumpy right now. Just go to bed, and you send her a video message in the morning. Joe, take a seat, bro. She's Joe. gonna know. You got your crucifix in your back. You're a good God fearing <laughs> man. And you know, here's what I'm hey, telling you. Show what a fan you put up. Uh, I mean, show what that fan you put up. Please in the tell kitchen. me that's where it goes. Dude. Heart to me in your arms. Let's go full throttle. Back up. I He's just saying out of the gates, let's just be boyfriend, girlfriend. I, I mean, know we had a 
minimal meeting yesterday. And this, also, she blew him off and said, I'm thinking... She's told him I'm thinking about getting back together with my wife. Without boyfriend. a doubt, she established that she wanted nothing to do with him <laughs> by saying, A, I have a, I, I'm thinking about getting back together with my ex-boyfriend. That I, is, we're not going to fuck. Know, I know what you're saying. I got to prove myself, Theo. <laughs> no, I respect... And you know that he was just in the pocket. He was just like sitting there with a beer listening to her. I'm like, yeah, yeah, of course. Mm -hmm. Why mm -hmm. wouldn't you? Yeah, no, I'm sorry. I'm no, I'm not. I'm a little preoccupied. I gotta pick up dry cleaning in the morning. He goes, yeah, no, actually, I gotta go back in time because there's a kidnapper <laughs> who's actually tormenting 1920s Toledo, <laughs> yes, Ohio. He goes, have you ever heard of the Lindenberg baby? <laughs> he goes, I gotta solve that. Also, I got this Zodiac killer really weighing on my mind. I gotta go back to San Francisco and fucking solve this. Anyways, he goes, hey, I'm only in New York for a little bit of time. You see. I gotta travel back and kill Son of Sam, but I gotta be in the city where it happened for me to so, travel. And it's one of the weird little tricks of time travel. You wouldn't understand that, but I'd like you to get to understand that if I could take you maybe to my house. I'd like to get a, you under me. A boom, uh, bang, <laughs> boom, 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 <laughs> boom, bang, bang. Yeah, you know where you learned that? Through the history of time. Oh, I'd like you to come over and try my sauce. It comes out of my two meatballs and sausage. <laughs> oh! Ah! Oh, yeah. hey, also, oh, also. Oh. I should let you know, I am a part-time DJ. <laughs> yeah. It's everything close. Hey. Hey, Julia. You seem like a really good girl, eh? I just want to get back together with my ex-boyfriend. Leave me alone, you fucking creep. Oh, these pants, the Cavaricis. Thanks for asking. Who are you? Yeah. I'm okay with pleats still. What? So let me get your number, eh? Um, I got an ex-boyfriend I'm thinking about getting back together with. Yeah, I said, right? Don't go back to time. I mean, I got it. It's my job. I'm a time cop. Oh, that sounds awesome. I'm going to go get another drink. No, I said time cop. Yeah, no, no, no. I like Jean-Claude Van Damme, too. What do you want to drink? I get you a drink. I can't hear you. I got to go. Come on. I get you a roofy cocktail. Yeah, yeah. I'm just busting your gabons. Yeah, I'm just busting your yeah. gabons. And then her in the car, she goes, I think I gave that guy my real number by accident. <laughs> and he goes, come on, Joe. Come on, Joey, Joe. Joey, come on, off. Joey. Hold off. Tonight's going to be too weird. Tomorrow, just right. <laughs> you Tomorrow, you pound. <laughs> <laughs> right now, you let her go. And if it's truly meant to be, tomorrow, you force her hand. <laughs> <laughs> you just come out, bro. Just say you're going to do it. Wait, she says she worked at Dress Barn. Now... There's 14 dress bonds in the metropolitan area. But the one by Coco's is <laughs> Northeast. <laughs> now, if I canvass the area, in the next four days, I could probably surprise that world. You know, I'm going to bring her flowers. I don't know. Maybe I'll even go check that Buffalo Exchange. <laughs> she, she's in there. Because, you know, I, they're owned by the dress bond. And she might, you know, pull double duty. She seems like a hard worker. I know she was wearing vanilla pear from Bed Bath & Beyond. So I went to every Bed Bath & Beyond. And I physically harassed every manager to give me the security tapes. Finally, they pulled your credit card information for me. <laughs> I got you social. No big whoop, though. I'm not going to use it for nothing weird. He uses his time cop powers, like uh, what was unlawful entry? Remember yeah. Ray Liotta just kept using his cop powers to get more and more information? I keep, you know what's funny is I pump fake the hello. You saw me pump fake the hello? I got it! Yeah! It's, Dude, I got we... one. I got one couldn't turn Ben into this guy, Joe, real oh. easy. Just, I'm talking about head shape. Yeah. Solely. Well, let's see what Joe's got more to offer. But I don't you. know if we have enough money to pay him to get out of orange. <laughs> he goes, can I wear an orange wig? He's like, God, God damn it. Here's the thing, Ben. God damn it, Ben. Wear a wig. Open up your heart to me in your arms. What? Let's go full throttle. <laughs> I could see me falling in love with you. Oh. Joe. Chill. You just, I don't know, I just looked in your eyes and I just melt. Hi. Anyhow, I'm heading off to work. This is my cute little home. Everything you see behind me, I built everything. Every oh, Christine, room. wait, you, you awed. But, I mean, really, though? This wouldn't the next day? You're a sad sack, too. You wouldn't, you wouldn't <laughs> I'm not going to answer the question. You wouldn't be the next no, day? No, I would totally be creeped out, but it's just like, this guy's so sweet. You make me melt. <laughs> <laughs> And uh, I got to go to work today, which means I'm a real psycho and this is being done at around 7 church. <laughs> so, uh, you know, the birds are up. I'm up pouring my heart out. I'm going to hit the construction site. Yo, 
I'm just a dego standing in front of some dinghy broad <sighs> telling him I think I could possibly fall in love with him between my woodworkings. <sighs> so he starts breaking down the house things he made. He goes, everything from the top molding to the... Uh, Hold on, let's just see <laughs> it. Yeah, back it up a little bit. Little home, everything you see behind me, I built everything. Every square inch from crown molding to chair rail Yikes. to floors to lighting to plumbing. He goes, yeah, I bet you, bet you didn't know I could just crush Long Island iced teas all night. <laughs> I'm actually gluing my hands, if you know what I mean. The fake palm tree, the drywall, the, the light switch, switch, the dimmer switch. <laughs> the floor, the hardwood, the carpet, the back to hardwood. The futon, <laughs> the indoor-outdoor carpet. I built... Everything, my shirt, my pants, <laughs> I can sew. The hot tub, the sink, <laughs> the name, shower. He says, "Good night, mooning his whole apartment." <laughs> I, built, I built the window. Every <laughs> night I say good night to everything I made. <laughs> now I start from the bottom to the top. <laughs> Good night, boiler. Good night, Good night pipes. Good night, grout work. Good night, foundation. <laughs> Good night, foundation. Good night, gravel. I had to stock behind some railroad ties to make the outdoor, <laughs> the the in ground outdoor porch. I uh, I do have a psychiatrist who says it's severe OCD. <laughs> <laughs> Good night, brackets for the awning. I still have on order, but I haven't gotten to put up yet. But when I do, bajong. <laughs> But when I do, bajong. Yeah, Holy shit. Good night, time sprinklers <laughs> that I have that I put in to a system of different underground work. Uh, uh, good night, ring do video doorbell, <laughs> which I recently purchased. With the floodlight cam. <laughs> <laughs> with the tracking floodlight cam. No, you don't understand. My nan is got mixed up with a couple of bad people. <laughs> she, she's in a bad group. She got mixed up with some bad people. I got to watch my nan because I'm that kind of guy. Oh I God. did a door rails. I did a chair rails. A crown molding. <laughs> a crown molding. That's great. Good, keep, what does he keep naming? Back up. Back up. Yeah. Oh, God. This is my cute little home. Oh, everything you see behind me, I built everything. Every square inch from crown molding to chair rail to floors to lighting to plumbing, doors, windows. So this is the type of guy you're getting. I'm a very handy guy. And, Pause uh, it. Let's take a break, and we'll come back and finish this. You guys silly? I'm just looking at that. Dad. Hey, Julia, it's me. This is my 11th phone call. I just said you can't hold the breast, listen to the tones, and I thought I may try cutting my thigh to make some of the bad feelings go away. I just wanted to see if you feel the way I feel <laughs> about how bad this is going. It's the Bonfire Comedy Central Radio, Sirius XM 95. I'm Dan Soder. That's Big J. Okerson. Uh Our guest will be on another time. Michelle Wolf got stuck in traffic, but she will be on the show another yeah, day. Yeah, I don't want a slider have her come in for 10 minutes. Yeah, that's weird. We don't, we don't want snack size, Michelle. I can just do my Michelle impression the whole time. No, hey, want... everybody! <laughs> Uh, check out her special Nice Lady on HBO Go. Back to Joe and Julia. Joe, really spilling his heart out. Let's go back a little bit. Back up a little bit always. I, I just want to hear about his grout work and his molding. He's really proud of it. Everything you see here, I made with my cum. He goes, you see those right there? Those are Spencer rivets. I had to buy extra special rivets for that drain. Guys, it's ben, hard to get somewhere. You can't get it everywhere. Yeah, Ace Hardware. Don't sell them no more. Uh, ben left Debalone all in the studio. Oh yeah, and the Ben is away. This is when we start. Do we start pressed hamming her now? <laughs> <laughs> this is where we make our play. If I know anything about the current climate, it's go for it. What's the? Uh, someone told me a sex thing we could do to her there called the. You know, like the dirty Sanchez and the, what are they called? The sex turns. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, the the peaking groundhog. I think it was called. Oh, where when you have to take a shit, you spread your butt cheeks across the glass, <laughs> and then you let it come out like cat glass and go back away. <laughs> Ah, uh, that's too much butthole strength. I'm just, peaking, yeah. Because if it just tumbles out, <laughs> groundhogs out. Oh, oh, early winter. Oh, oh God! <laughs> I'm Puxatani feeling it. I'm Puxatani feeling it. Up oh, Indian summer. No. Yeah. Did you find it at all? No. The peaking. You weren't listening. Oh, I thought you were going to say if I was right. That's what it was called. Oh no! Sorry, I was. Uh texting the guest <laughs> yeah guess there is no guest it. there is no guest play the video every square inch from crown molding <laughs> to chair rail to floors to lighting to plumbing 
doors, windows. Goes, I've only had seven on record fires. He <laughs> goes, I'm not really an electrician. Uh, Julia, I did not ask you, but if you work for the city, keep this ho hum. Huh? <laughs> my house is completely illuminated by tap light. Goes, I'm not going to lie. The city doesn't even know I'm uh, jacked into their power source. I haven't paid for utilities since uh, fucking Clinton was in office. I went to a dry cleaners. I stole a telephone company outfit. I now climb the poles. I pulled the cable from one guy. I pulled the thing over here from him. I pulled this. I pulled that. Bop, bing, bang, bang, boom. Next thing you know, I got two I got two uh, ceiling fades in my kitchen. That's the kind of guy that I am. So this is the type of guy you're getting. Yeah. I'm a very handy guy. And, uh, and a very handsy guy. Uh, <laughs> uh, bada boom, bada bing. I'll see you later. Maybe not. I'll have to build you whatever you want. You're a sweetheart. Can you build me my ex-boyfriend back? Yeah. Can you? Oh, baby, girl, that hurts. <laughs> oh, you hurt me so. You know how to cut me right to the core. <laughs> <laughs> Can you construct me, my ex-boyfriend caring about me? Oh. Oh, you got me right in the can tomatoes. Oh. <laughs> bocce balls. Oh, bocce balls. <laughs> Julia, that hurts so much. Oh, I'm going to be sleeping on my oh, side tonight. I haven't been this hurt since old Blue Eyes died. Uh, got to do it. I saw you last night at that club. I tell you, my brajol hasn't boned up like that <laughs> since the split second when they faded out of the screen from Pacino and Godfather 2 into De Niro. <laughs> it was a split second, and I boned up just like last night. That's why I knew you was the one. I talked to you, and I said, this is the one. God has given me an angel. <laughs> oh. I hope this video doesn't scare you. <laughs> but that's how I feel. I just want you to know that. Okay? And I look forward to uh, going out to dinner with you. Whoa! So, let's make it happen. Mwah! Whoa! Ciao, baby. Ciao. Ew. Ciao, baby. Oh, buddy. Uh, is there a response video? How is there not a Julia response? First off, you fucking dickhead. I told you I didn't want a fucking cocktail. I was there with my girls. And you was all up in my shit. My ex-boyfriend is going to fucking murder you. You hear me, Joe? You're <laughs> fucking dead. Are there fucking uh, good comments under it? I, Not that I'm seeing, just a couple things up top. Nothing really. Just shut the hell up. <laughs> yeah, dude, this guy just fucking... Shut the hell up. You fucking... Oh, man. I wish we could find out more about him. Joe? Oh, yeah. I bet there's more on about him. Oh, God. In the world, for sure. And if this is this is the problem, this is World Star Hip Hop's comments, which never are that really good, quite honestly. Has it gone to YouTube yet? I mean, of mm. course, we got YouTube first, probably. We, we, I mean, I feel like we could learn a lot more about this guy. Oh, Joe? Yeah, oh, I mean, absolutely. I feel like we could now get, I want to know about Julia. I want to get Joe and Julia on the show <laughs> and try to have a love connection. Yeah, Chuck Woolery, this shit back he's in like, two and yeah. two. He's like, hey, I built you a dishwasher, Julia. I go, Julia. Guess. Hi, Dan Soder, Jay Okerson from the Bonfire. What would it take for <laughs> Joe to build you? Oh, it's live leak? It's on a couple different YouTube sites. Wow, really? Oh, we gotta find out where the fucking... Where, where Patient Zero the original. is. Yeah, we gotta find the original. Isn't These it? all gotta, have less views than the World Star one. These have like 21 views. Yeah, we gotta find the fucking... The Outbreak Monkey to find out who leaked the video. Maybe it's this one? Julia... Hey, it's Julia. Me. Hey, it's me. <laughs> Remember loud talking Joe? My ears are still buzzing from the he club goes, last night. I know you're in your 20s and I'm in my 40s, but that is really the only difference as I can tell is my ears is banged up. They tells me 40 is the new 20. <laughs> I says the new 20. I don't know who you are, but leave me alone. Yeah, what? Yeah, I do. I shave everything down there. <laughs> you want me to Snapchat you? I can Snapchat you it. <laughs> yeah. Hey. You want to see? I'll see if I can fit the whole thing in one picture with the curve. I got the curve. <laughs> the curve. <laughs> you guys. I mean, I wonder. In we can find we can find Joe online. Well, but Julia's the one I want. You want to see who Jul Julia is? Oh yeah, I want to see Julia. That'd be fantastic. There's no Julia videos. Can we make a Julia response? No, there's no video? response. She just put this up on YouTube. Julia just dumped this dude to die on the internet. I mean, t this guy is a bad judge of character. I mean, 
Wait, just can you just play the beginning again? Just how happy he is to send her this video. Hey, Julia, it's me, your big poppy Good morning, bear. Julia. <laughs> Good morning, <laughs> Julia. Just wanted to say hi. <laughs> Wish you a great day. Oh, that's so great. Tell you that meeting you yesterday. Aye. It's fucking Paul, it's it's Paul Verzi's was... older brother. <laughs> yeah. He goes, it's Joe Verzi. Hey, I did everything in my house. All the woodworkings and fixtures you see. I use a chisel like Michelangelo himself. Goes, now, I know you're saying something about your ex-boyfriend. Be a real big mistake if your ex-boyfriend went missing. I'm just saying maybe <laughs> yeah. I got friends. You know, you said you didn't want me to talk to your friends. <laughs> you tell your ex-boyfriend, Brian, if he got some gambling debts, I'll make a phone call. Bang him out. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I can make a little deal with your ex-boyfriend, Brian, and he uh, stays out of the picture. My friends who can heard him stay out of the picture. Hey, Joe, what's wrong? He goes, just got back from a case and uh, I was fighting some crime in 2,122. It's crazy shit I can't even talk about. Came back. That bitch put me all over the YouTube. Goes, go. And it's not like in 3029 when the internet's just in your brain. You know, I know that because I'm a time cop. It still hurts. It hurts. <laughs> and the comment section isn't just a bunch of neurons firing like it is in 4018. 4118. Um, There's no black people making fun of this on World Star Hip Hop? Yeah, of course there are. Like in the comment section? But they don't say that much. White boy with red skin. Who hates himself? I mean, she nailed it. <laughs> you think he um, hates himself? I'm not getting that. No, nah, I think he was going for it. He was shooting his shot. Yeah. I, do you, now, I think that a guy like this, like, this didn't break This didn't break a his stride for a second. Do he's you like, think he knows he's, he's out like, on the internet? Fuck that cow. I didn't want her anyway. Yeah, he falls in love like this every night. Dude, if we could somehow find Joe... I want to find Joe. Joe's got a Joe has a big heart, and he's ready to fucking. But also, he could come in and imagine all the the track lighting he could fix for us in here. Oh my god, could you imagine not having to deal with this bullshit track lighting <laughs> we have in here? Joe goes, in, he comes in, he goes, listen, after I had a look at you. I love that. That's how he says he looked at Julia, but also that's how he would look at the track lighting. <laughs> he goes, listen, I take a look at that track lighting, and uh, I can't get out of my head since I saw it. <laughs> and normally, I was going to call you tomorrow with an estimate, but I think I'm going to do it. Now. He goes, oh. I'm putting myself out there. He goes, I could probably do this for under 1500 Oh, God, it hurts. He goes, if you guys are willing to go non-union, I, <laughs> I can stay within the estimate. Oh, I'm just too emotional right now. I'm telling you, it's going to look so good. I, I'll be willing to do it at cost. Oh, God. Because oh, we know Joe is in the tri-state area by the accent. Oh my god. Oh, yeah. I mean, we I'm, think he's down the street from Lou. I'm telling you, I'm the only guy who could build stuff like this in all of Des Moines, Iowa. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> That's the thing about living up here in Missoula, Montana. <laughs> <laughs> no one makes a good gravy. <laughs> he goes, being this close to the Dakotas as I am, <laughs> non disclosed location. You know me, I'm on native land. <laughs> ah, dude, let's get you on the show. I wish Jacob was here so we could send him after him like a little bird dog. It says, uh, John of Virginia says it was originally posted to the Intero Bang, so maybe there's some good comments. Whoa, I mean, well, if it's the Intero Bang, we can just go right to the top. We know the editor in chief. We know the brass. We know the brass up there. We can get their sources. <laughs> this is a real fucking deep throat situation. We can, and the investigative journalism, not the porno film. Oh, wow. But we could break this thing wide open. I think we can get Joe on the show. More oh. importantly, I think we could get Julia. We get her number from Joe. Oh yeah, <laughs> yeah. Give it goes. Yeah, call her, bitch. I don't even care. Yeah, good, watch this. You go. Good luck of her even picking up. And we call once. I go. Hi, this is uh, Dan Soder from Sirius XM's Bonfire. I was just wondering if you'd come on the show. That'd be great if we go. I say, hey, we get Julius number. He goes. Yeah, but listen. Don't go on the same day. <laughs> yeah. Wait a couple of days. He goes, I just want to let you guys know if you fell in love with her the way I did, don't send her a video. No way this is fucking true. D uh, Rich, North Carolina, is this a guess or is this something you know? No, when it first came out, and if I'm wrong, I'm a dick and I apologize, but when that video first came out, I could swear I heard it 
somewhere that it was or, or read that it was her Uber driver because there was a debate about how he was able to get her number. Dude. But you may want to look into D- Does that not crank up the creepiness? Dude. By the, not only does it crank, crank up the creepiness, it also really tells you. Dude. Like it actually makes things make more sense. Like, because he, he doesn't say that she was like talking to him. In like a oh, let's hook up environment dude, of a club, oh it's, he does say he goes. You were telling me about go back to where he says the thing, Christine. You were telling me about wanting to get back with your ex boyfriend, but I'm saying don't look back. No one moves back. Yeah, well, start from him. Yeah, start. Uh, it's me, Joe. I'll be honest. With you, we're probably we're probably one degree of separation with Gino Bisconti from this guy. <laughs> <laughs> you think Gino's held trivia night before, and this guy's won? <laughs> yeah, he goes. I, I, I met you at Quizzo last <laughs> night. I can't believe it. it Dude, hurts. if this guy is her Uber driver, That's so crazy. I will. F- we have to get him on the show. That way amps up the creepy. Let's see it. I want to okay. say hi. Wish you a great day. Tell you that meeting you yesterday. And getting a look at you was probably one of the greatest moments of my life. You were so beautiful. In the back You don't know how beautiful. I love that you, you take a water. <laughs> he goes, he goes, he goes, you didn't even ask me if I use Waze or Google Maps. <laughs> was, you didn't you didn't link to my Spotify to take over the thing. Because you respect my space, baby girl. You let the sweet sounds of Dano play. Ooh, ooh, oh. You know, you know, I love my Rat Pack Pandora. <laughs> <laughs> Sammy Davis, oh, my bunch of cool. Hey, come on now. He goes, you only get three skips in an hour. <laughs> A darker hour, you know what I mean. I get three skips. I got to amp up the pro. I'm getting all these moyans in my thing, in my playlists. I mean, if it, if my if my playlist was enabled, I tell my ma to move. I go, ma, you got to move. Uh, I swear to God. Only oh, thing better than you giving me five stars was when you told me I could make you a stuffed man of God. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, go back. Go back. Don't hear when he says the thing. Rich, I think you're on to something Dude, here, Rich, buddy. I really hope you're on to something. If this guy's his, her Uber driver... I don't know what to believe. Maybe this guy's not even a time cop. <laughs> I don't think so. Yeah. <laughs> Is this guy really a time cop? Good morning, Julia. Hey, Meet baby, Joe. boo By the way, that is something that you say when someone wakes up in the backseat of your car. You go, good morning, Julia. 4.86 stars. <laughs> hey, wakey, wakey, cakeys, huh? Good thing you don't have to blow into a thing to start this thing, right? <laughs> I mean, I do because I'm court ordered to do it. <laughs> but we are still on the upper level of the George Washington, and it is locked. <laughs> we are on a bit of Tefic. I'm telling you, it is locked like my ex-wife's house. <laughs> I try to get in. He's a Mama, Mama Luke. Luke. He is a Mama, Mama Luke. Luke. Good call, yeah. Stephanie Falcone. He is a real Mama Luke. <laughs> yeah, Mama <laughs> Chochiani. Yeah. yeah. Uh, God, let's keep going when he says he's a time cop. Just wanted to say hi. Wish you a great day. Wow. Tell you that meeting you yesterday and getting a look at you was probably Something. one of the greatest moments of my life. Getting mm. to look at you. You were so you. beautiful. You don't know how beautiful you are to me. You got rid of the fart smell from the guy before you. <laughs> yeah, I had to pick up an Indian, not my choice. And uh, let's just say the back seat was a little moist. <laughs> Anyways, you didn't even bat an eye. You didn't even look up, but I saw the glow from your phone illuminate you. Anyway. I'm reaching out to you because I just want you to know that smell wasn't me. That wasn't it. <laughs> there was Can a I guy just... before you. You're gorgeous. You're precious. And uh, but it's been sitting in my mind when you said to me you want to go back with your ex boyfriend. Yeah, I mean, like if a girl says she wants to get back with it, her ex boyfriend, means fuck off. I know. Oh my god, but Michelle's got such great opinions on this. <laughs> She's just sitting opinion? there with headphones Wolf, on. Jump in for five minutes. Here, right there, that mic. No, just pull it down. I see you biting lips over there. Yeah. <laughs> and this is what happens when you're late. I, you... I know, I know. Yeah. Hey. Hey, hey, Michelle, hey, Michelle Wolf, Wolf, everybody. Oh, this isn't Dan's impression of me. This is the real me. <laughs> or is this the real me? <laughs> Who's the real? I don't know. <laughs> no one knows. It's everyone. It's fun for everybody. <laughs> Which is the real Michelle? Don't shoot me. I'm the real Michelle. <laughs> what do I do? Jane. What do I do? Who's the real? Who's the real? Jane, don't shoot me. Don't shoot me. <laughs> um, what's your opinion? I mean, I mean, first of all,
of all, he's, he's got one of those goatees that's like, it's too much hair. Yeah. There's just too much hair around. There's no this thing here. Yeah, it's, it's, it's the it reverse goes, Homer Simpson. It goes all the way to the lip on the bottom. Yeah, it's the whole way. Like, the whole thing goes all it's the way like to the lip. It's like he had to shave his lips. <laughs> now, I tend not to like Tuesdays because that's lip shaving day. And sometimes I get dinged up. Baby, I don't want to see you. I don't want you to see me like this when my hair grows over my lip. Wanna, I didn't want to kiss you because I had some stubble on my lips. <laughs> had I known I was going to meet a beautiful woman, I would have waxed my lips. <laughs> yeah, these, are, these are nice wax but, and kiss them. But Rich here in North Carolina said that he believes it's, uh, that he might be an Uber driver. And the... The wording all falls very in line with that. I yeah. mean, I 100% believe he's an Uber driver. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Make no mistake. This guy is an Uber driver. And I'll tell you this. He's a guy that doesn't react where you and I get in the backseat of a car, where he goes, I know him, man. And then that's it. And then he starts driving, yeah. but Michelle gets in and he goes, why are you headed? <laughs> Let me get a look at you. I also love it. In his apartment, he has Christmas lights up. Like he decorated. Well, I mean, he, he did. He's a very handy man. All himself. And he yeah. explains that. He did all the work in his oh, house. He explains that at the great. end of the video. He gives you actually uh, a the, listed breakdown of everything he's made. The grout work, the doors. I mean, let's just keep playing the video to see how much it lines wait, up. Wait, if someone says to you they're getting back together with their ex-boyfriend, I can't think of a more direct... I'm, I'm not over interested. It. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, it's exactly funny if he it. goes, that's funny if that's what he took, because she goes, you're my fucking Uber driver, and I'm getting back together with my ex-boyfriend. He goes, I just heard that last part. He's like, <laughs> I know. I know that if you could just get to see the real me, and not just... My freaky eyes looking back at you in a rearview mirror. <laughs> I feel like you caught too much back ahead yeah. and not enough front ahead. Like, Can I offer you a water or a loose peanut M&M? <laughs> <laughs> goes, oh, look at that. A bottle cap. Save that. <laughs> Wait, back. Is this guy? Is this Tommy Dreamer? By oh, the way, dude, he really does look like Tommy Dreamer. Back it up a little bit because I want to hear about the boyfriend things. Now, now it's just let's do it straight through because it's, it's less than two minutes. Getting video. a look at you was part of one of the greatest moments of my it life. It all lines up with Uber. It was so beautiful. You don't know how beautiful you are to me. Hey. I mean, just you're gorgeous. You're precious. She's like, I'm aware of that. And I never said it. Didn't know that I wasn't pretty. Precious <laughs> is something you say to someone you're about to murder. Yeah. <laughs> you're precious. You're you're precious. Only I can have you. Oh, no one has you. Yeah. Uh, I consider you a trophy. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You're precious. Like, you know, almost like something like uh, I want to put above one of my mantle or something. I don't know. I just feel like, listen, you know I'm a handy guy. I got a basement full of traps and teases and tricks. <laughs> I, I just want to cut off your hair and snuggle with it. Yeah. <laughs> hey, do you want to play a game? Uh, your face is locked with this crazy contraption. <laughs> the key is in my dead ma over there. <laughs> you got to come She's been dead for years, but I do a voice thing. I do. Uh, I go, baby, why are you? Who's the lady? I, it's fun. I do voices. I scared. go, Ma, shut up, Ma. I'm go, trying to entertain Julia. Hey, Julia. Don't be scared, baby. Don't be scared. Shh, shh, shh. No, my mom's not here no more. She's gone. She's gone now. I mean, physically, she's still here. She's right there. You can see her skeleton. I, I know you can smell her. Right? It's kind of numbed out for me. I put this stuff in my nose on the inside. And just... Shut up, Ma. Get out of my head. Oh, you fuck you. Get the fuck out of my head. I'm sorry, Joel. You guys see me like this. It's just a weird day. He goes, but you know when you're meeting the family, in one false swoop. <laughs> Are you supposed to be on medication? He goes, yeah, but it makes me sweat when I go to sleep. I don't like that. He goes, also, it kills my sex drive. <laughs> yeah. Very handy. He said it was cutting my bum. He was, he was cutting off my guillons. Hey. <laughs> I go, hey, I go, ain't no guy in a lab coat going to take away my bean bag. My guy got to go guillons. This is the article from the Interrobang. Uh, oh, so Joe goes to the same gym as Julia. Yep. And when he saw her going into the tanning room... Already awkward. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> hey, you? I noticed she was about to be naked in a minute. <laughs> <laughs> and getting blasted with fake sun. <laughs> he goes, if there's nothing I like, it's a hot broad being cooked in a gym. <laughs> you smell like turkey. Ooh, let me check the temperature. <laughs> hey, let me dip the thermometer in there. Oh, I just right. <laughs> <laughs> so, you're in a you're in a coffin already. <laughs> Let's goes, just close this baby yeah. up, make it a done deal. He goes, I, I, he goes, you're like a sexy panini. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> that's a press sandwich for all the people who live out Let here in Des Moines, Iowa, where I live. <laughs> where, where I live in Lincoln, Lincoln Nebraska. Let me I... put some provolones on <laughs> top of you. Oh, you put that cream on. <laughs> like it's like a govaru. Jim goes to the same, uh, Joe goes to the same Jim as Julia when he saw her going into the tanning room where you need to write down your name. He took the chance to find out her name and started calling out uh, to her when she came out. He then called himself from her phone. How did he do that, though? He called himself from her idea. phone the next morning. Sent her a video of himself oh. professing his love to her. If you're going to have a stalker, one who works out and is good at building things does not seem ideal. No, well, it doesn't. I mean, is he striking you as like a... My, hey, my roommate's cousin Julia went to a bar, got hammered, and woke up to find this video text to her in the morning. Which is weird because that's not the story. That yeah, doesn't what? Match I don't. Story. I'm not understanding that actually. I, want, yeah. I like it when he's from. I like it. He's Uber driver. I like the Uber driver. This is just. This, this is almost as weird. But I'm saying more like, I, he stole her phone. I don't get. That. Good morning, Julia. December sixth. Like, he made it. He made it her screensaver. So when she got her phone back, <laughs> goes, "Hey, baby, you look so good I'm walking over there. Remember when? <laughs> remember when you said I really can't talk now, but I have a boyfriend I'm trying to get back with. So this is from- finish that sentence. <laughs> <laughs> this is from December 2015. Yeah. So this is uh, over two years ago. It two says 2017. Ago, yeah. No, this is. Oh, actually, that but, one does. But look seem- down. Go down. Scroll down, and it says something from 2015. December 16th, 2015 was the infamous day Joe first said good morning to Julia. <laughs> um, Let's go full throttle. Yeah. That's the best part. Go back to the video. So but, we, hey, know, before, we have to go. It's, yeah. it's past 8 o'clock. But I want to tell, ask Michelle, because she wasn't here when they asked that question. How would you feel if the day after you met somebody who creepily watched you go tan... And he called you the next day and just said, you know what? Let's just go full throttle. Let's not even worry about dating. I could fall in love with you. Does that make you go, uh, I mean, I'll meet him at Three of Cups or something? Yeah. <laughs> no, that makes me get a new phone. Yeah. yeah. That's a- Good job. Joe's pushing new phones. Yeah. He was, uh, he, then you go mom. to Verizon and he works there. He goes, how you doing? I'm Joe. I work at Verizon. Can I help you? He raises his eyebrows. He's like, oh, no. That's, that's the end of the, of the uh, Twilight Zone episode. Yeah. Oh, God, he's everywhere. He's everywhere. He goes, hey, it's me, Joe. I'm also here at T-Mobile. Oh, I'm like the guy that switched over to at and I have everywhere. a lot of jobs because I need to make money to afford to buy all the moldings. I got to put my house. 